Hello everyone. Welcome to the playlist of basic electrical engineering. In this session, I will be discussing the relation between line and phase quantities of delta connection. In the previous session, I have discussed what is delta connection, how the delta connection can be done, why delta connection is required, etc. Moving on to the discussion, I will be deriving an expression for the line voltage and phase voltage and the line current and phase current in delta connector system. First of all, please consider the particular circuit diagram. Everybody can see the circuit diagram, how the delta connection is formulating. The ending of first coil is connected to starting of another coil. So, you can able to see there are three coils. See, ending of coil 1 is connected to beginning of another coil. Ending of another coil is connected to beginning of another coil. Like that, there is a connection. This type of connection is suitable for high current and low voltage application. First of all, I want to derive the relation between uh, the phase voltage and line voltage. Look at the line voltage. So, what are the line voltage? Line voltages are VRY, VRY line that is equal to, what about the phase voltage? VR, if you want you can write the VRY phase or V, this is here they have written as VR phase, both are fine only, VRY phase. Likewise, you can write VYB line is equal to VYB VYB phase. One more is remaining VRB VRB line equal to this is VRB. VRB means VBR. Both are same only. See VRB line that is equal to VRB phase. This is your VRB phase. VRB or VB also fine. No issue. VRB phase. What does it mean? In case of delta connector system, it is concluded that the line voltage will be always equal to phase voltage. Both are identical in case of delta connector system. Make a note of this everybody. Delta connect system line voltage is equal to phase voltage. It is very clear from the diagram. Line voltage and phase voltage will be equal. Now what I am going to do is, I need to check whether the line current is equal to phase current or not. No, it never happens. No. This is your phase current. You can see the phase current and this is your line current. Will line current equal to phase current? Never. Both are different now. Delta connection. Now we have to prove the relation between the line current and phase current. Do one thing, you can mark the line current first. I am going to draw the phase diagram of line current. So, let me draw the phase diagram of line current. So, everybody please observe here. So, next is relation between. Relation between. Line current and phase current. This is actually a relation between. line voltage and phase voltage moving on to the derivation first of all please mark all the phase current let us mark the phase current first so i am going to draw ir first ir means ir phase okay i will be like right make a ir ph or ir phase for your convenience. I R phase. Next is I Y. This is your I Y. Both are 120 degree apart now. So I would like to draw in this fashion. I Y phase. Then uh, what about uh, I B? I B is 120 degree apart from I Y. So this is this should be the I B. You can draw neatly by using the scale. This is your I B you can draw and write neatly for your exam correct all are 120 degree apart if you want you can mark the angle also it is understood now now what i will do is i am going to extend iy in the opposite direction 
i y let me extrapolate this is your positive plus i y now in the opposite direction i am going to extend i y it is very clear that if i extend i y it will it comes like this only hope you are agreeing with me okay mark it properly in the negative direction now it becomes uh, how much negative of i y phase negative of i i y phase now do one thing draw the resultant how to draw the resultant at a middle only right you studied parallelogram law vector addition this could be the resultant this could be the resultant what is the value of resultant resultant will be you can write the resultant will be i i r lag okay please extrapolate the parallelogram you can ex, uh, do the modification of parallelogram you can construct you can extrapolate by using dotted lines this for the construction purpose the total angle between ib and ir phase that will be 120 degree now it is getting divided as 60 into 60 this portion will be 60 obviously this portion also will be 60 okay so mark accordingly now i need to calculate the resultant which is the resultant ir line ir line is the result and i am going to draw uh, draw here ir line i am going to write here ir line that is the resultant that is equal to apply the parallelogram law how we can apply first one is ir phase ir phase magnitude square plus minus i y phase magnitude square plus 2 into magnitude of i r phase into minus i y phase into cos 60 do one thing elaborate it i r line is equal to square root of i r phase square plus i y phase square plus 2 into i r phase into i r phase into i y phase into cos 60 means 1 by 2 so 1 2 and 2 get cancelled now do one thing uh, instead of uh, this i r phase you can able to say that this is your i r i r phase now instead of i r phase i'll be writing i phase only so instead of uh, i r line i'm going to write i l i l is equal to i phase square plus this becomes i phase square plus 2 and 2 got cancelled no so i phase into i phase means i phase square what does it mean implies i l is equal to square root of i phase square plus i phase root plus i phase square that is 3 i phase square so what does it mean for the simplification root 3 into i phase so in conclusion the line current will be equal to root 3 times phase square likewise if you want you can draw for other side also so you can draw from here and this side also you can able to make out that's also possible but this is sufficient for us il is equal to root 3 times i phase so what we understood is so we have derived the relationship between uh, the line current and phase current the line current will be equal to root 3 times phase current line current is always greater than phase current in delta connection and uh, we we identify that uh, line voltage is identical with the phase voltage may i know if you are having any queries you can put up in the comment box definitely i am going to revert thank you for listening this video